Welcome to AnchorCast, a weekly podcast of homilies and sermons from Christ Our Anchor Anglican Mission in Nashville, Tennessee. The Lord Almighty grant us a peaceful night and a perfect end. Amen. Our help is in the name of the Lord, who hath made heaven and earth. Let us humbly confess our sins unto Almighty God. Almighty God and Father, we confess to Thee, to one another, and to the whole company of heaven that we have sinned through our own fault in thought, word, and deed, and in what we have left undone. For the sake of Thy Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, have mercy upon us. Forgive us our sins, and by the power of Thy Holy Spirit, raise us up to serve Thee in newness of life, to the glory of Thy name. Amen. May Almighty God grant us forgiveness of all our sins and the grace and comfort of the Holy Spirit. Amen. O God, make speed to save us. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Ghost, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. A reading from Psalm 41. Blessed is he that considereth the poor and needy. The Lord shall deliver him in the time of trouble. The Lord preserve him and keep him alive, that he may be blessed upon the earth, and deliver not thou him into the will of his enemies. The Lord comfort him when he lieth sick upon his bed. Make thou all his bed in his sickness. I said, Lord, be merciful unto me. Heal my soul, for I have sinned against thee. Mine enemies speak evil of me. When shall he die and his name perish? And if he come to see me, he speaketh vanity, and his heart conceiveth falsehood within himself, and when he cometh forth, he telleth it. All mine enemies whisper together against me. Even against me do they imagine this evil. An evil disease, say they, cleaveth fast unto him, and now that he lieth, he shall rise up no more. Yea, even mine own familiar friend whom I trusted, who did also eat of my bread, hath laid great weight for me. But be thou merciful unto me, O Lord, raise thou me up again, and I shall reward them. By this I know thou favorest me, and that mine enemy doth not triumph against me, and in my innocency thou upholdest me, and shalt set me before thy face forever. Blessed be the Lord God of Israel, world without end. Amen. Thou, O Lord, art in the midst of us, and we are called by thy name. Leave us not, O Lord, our God. Into thy hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit, for thou hast redeemed me, O Lord, thou God of truth. Keep me, O Lord, as the apple of thine eye. Hide me under the shadow of thy wings. Lord, have mercy upon us. Christ, have mercy upon us. Lord, have mercy upon us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever and ever. Amen. O Lord, hear our prayer and let our cry come unto thee. Let us pray. Visit this place, we beseech thee, O Lord, and drive far from it all snares of the enemy. Let thy holy angels dwell herein to preserve us in peace, and may thy blessing be upon us evermore through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Lighten our darkness, we beseech thee, O Lord, and by thy great mercy defend us from all perils and dangers of this night. For the love of thine only Son, our Savior, Jesus Christ. Amen. Be present, O merciful Lord, and protect us through the hours of this night, so that we who are wearied by the changes and chances of this life may rest in thine eternal changelessness. Through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Look down, O Lord, from thy heavenly throne, illumine the darkness of this night with thy celestial brightness, and from the children of light banish the deeds of darkness. Through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen.
O God, whose unfailing providence sustaineth the world we live in and the life we live, watch over those both night and day who work while others sleep, and grant that we may never forget that our common life depends upon each other's toil. Through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Guide us waking, O Lord, and guard us sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep we may rest in peace. Lord, now let us thou thy servant depart in peace according to thy word. For mine eyes have seen thy salvation, which thou hast prepared before the face of all people, to be a light to lighten the Gentiles, and to be the glory of thy people Israel. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Ghost, as it was in the beginning, as now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Guide us waking, O Lord, and guard us sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep we may rest in peace. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God. The Almighty and merciful Lord, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, bless us and keep us this night and evermore. Amen. Christ Our Anchor is an Anglican mission in East Nashville that meets on Wednesday evenings for prayer and fellowship. Follow us at ChristOurAnchor.org to learn more about the work God has called us to in East Nashville. And join us on Wednesday evenings at 5.30 as we live into what Jesus has called His church to be. Everyone is welcome. Welcome.